Game of Ruin in Germany, Russia, Scandinavia, Britain, France, Liberia, Italy, and the Balkans. Oh, that must be Joseph Goebbels' work. If you wanna know how this happened, you better watch the video. Sky Xerox Wait Dream starts in Germany, but not in any Germany. Imperial Germany. I don't really like Imperial Germany, so we're gonna have to make a new Germany. Firstly, before we establish game or rule over Germany, we're gonna have for the economy to fail. Economy failed? My god! Actually, this is a good thing because now we're gonna get the events for restructuring the economy. And we're just gonna click on the buttons that do not restructure the economy and make it fail. Of course, we're willing to help the Afghan brothers in the revolution. Afghan! 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 And here are the events for fixing the economy you know it's the basic things you know businesses failing banks failing people are hungry yeah i don't really care man i'm just gonna keep all the money for the kaiser and hope the revolution happens this is fine oh woman suffrage this is totally fine what do you mean a sinking ship the economy is doing great finally we can remove the imperialists and put gamers in power i was wondering who is the right guy to lead our armies in the german revolution and then i saw this happy face of joseph Goebbels. of course we're gonna choose him let the war commence <laughs> Oh, that was surprisingly easy. We just managed to encircle all of the Bavarian divisions. It'll soon be over. I didn't expect them to capitulate that fast, but cap capitulating is always good, so it's the start of a new Germany. That's how I'd be true, calling it the fall of Germany, considering that I'm still here. Ah, sweet victory. Ah, why do you have to join the international? Come on. It's time for the review of all parties, which nobody cares about because we all know which part I'm going. What do you mean that the Nationalist Party is the black sheep? I mean... Come on, they're, they're kind of fine, you know, we can put them in power for a hot second. What's the worst that can happen? Genocide? You guys know how most Kaiserings packs take like 20 minutes to complete a billion events? No, I just click this button and boom, now we have Goebbels. I'm very sorry to the one Jewish guy watching my YouTube channel, but I must proclaim the victory over Judea capitalism for the Goebbels spots. This is not my real political ideology, I just like making funny memes. I'm not gonna comment on every focus I do because they're all in German and I'm not exactly sure what they are but they're all pretty base talking about base let's form the stasi national cooperatism i heard of many economic policies but this one must be the craziest the focus body and blood it gives us decision to protect the german integrity like you know monetary sports basic animal rights banning tobacco environment protectionism what do you mean no global germany is bad i mean yeah we're gonna do, do some eugenics but that's not too bad four out of five good policies just like gamer most i think gamer Goebbels is actually pretty wholesome apparently our general civil war all my generals got deleted so let's do the roulette who are we gonna get a good general i don't know who that header guy is but he looks kind of cool I guess it's gonna call it a win. Uh, hail the Volksführer. So basically, we don't like democracy, we don't like the US, we don't like Judea capitalism, Deutschland and only Deutschland, you know, the typical national populist stuff. Well, uh, Goebbels and Adolf Hitler, the Austrian painter, are making a book. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this game is such a meme. I mean, amazing, amazing. Um, you know, our great leader Joseph Goebbels has some interesting ideas, definitely. But removing the Latin alphabet, really? They lay amongst us. <laughs> Understand this serious topic about Jews and shit, but but I, I can just not make an Among Us reference. Can you appreciate that it's called the RR officer? <laughs> this is just too silly. The Night of the. One more example of fiction imitating the real life. Ah, Germany reborn. Alright, I'm not gonna comment on what happened in the day in Munich because I'm gonna get demonetized, but you can imagine what happened. Oh, that's what happened with the Kai Command. This just kinda went outside for like a walk or something and now they're back when they did this focus. So Germany is back on the world stage to do tiny amounts of trolling. Actually, freak it, this time we're doing a lot of trolling. Can we stop talking about the Jews? They're kinda fine. They really haven't done that much. Um, hello, France, anybody there? Why are you declaring war on Spain? Talk about why France declared war on Spain and get the focus on imperialism. Alright, you know, maybe it's just me, but I feel like some of these buffs are a little bit overpowered. You can say that I got a gazillion of them, maybe. This maybe Germany is a little bit strong. But that's kind of the fun of it, isn't it? Ah, the Germania plan. This thing gives me decisions to just invade countries. I very much like that. I think it's about time for a force Anschluss. And so it begins. Rebozo. Though I very much like the super Germany Victoria two borders, I think we need to start some 
national socialist revolutions around. Okay, this is hilarious. When you release a quote unquote puppet, it's not a puppet, it's just a Stoutpok member, which just means they're a puppet but with extra steps. Germania, Puan Germania. Yeah, basically, we get even more places to attack, you know, it's very cool, you know. And the trolling begins. We started trolling, but you know, even more trolling is never bad. Switzerland? Nah, that's just Germany, bro. Lithuania? It's not really Germany, but we will make it Germany. Just I have a decision to call Poland. And, you know, we can talk about if Germany actually has cores on Poland and should have cores on Poland. But if we get rid of all the Poles, it doesn't really matter, right? This is the Tornado proof Disco Panzer. Oh, the invasion of Denmark. Let's see, can I beat him in 6 hours or 7? Alright, can we talk about this? Isolate the French. Details. It gives me decisions to something something. Clicks here. No decisions to something something. Oh no, a small city fell to piracy. What should I do? Now that I have deployed my disco panzers on the Belarusian border for um peacekeeping force, finally declare the war on France and end this menace. Now we have deal with the small Belarusian problem. It's time to go actually after France. And I have decided to position my tanks in some historical areas. Oh, just because for the memes. As you can see, my historical invasion of France is going great. But while I'm invading France, why don't you tell me a fun and original video idea? And who knows? Maybe I'll play it. A beautifully historical French circumvent around cowards. It's not as big as in historically, but it's good enough. After killing all surrounding troops, it was time to go to the second stop for the Tour de France, aka Paris. And of course, the siege was incredibly easy, and after I secured this humongous encirclement, the days of the French Commune were numbered. GG France, you know, you fought well, but I'm just better. I think I ever showed you guys how to do naval invasion of Britain, so here's the official tornado tutorial. First of all, have one gazillion amount of cars. Put it over the English Channel and do na naval strike. And now, wait. After some time, you start hitting some submarines. Mostly submarines, but also some other ships. I don't know if I mentioned this, but you're gonna need a lot, a lot of naval bombers. Be because look how many they're dying. We're literally suicide bombing onto them. But because I produce so much, it actually doesn't matter. After some time, you're gonna be able to put your navy in the English Channel without getting blown up immediately. And as soon as you get green navy, you want your naval evasion into Dover or something, and hopefully, just hopefully, you're gonna land. When you land, try to secure a port. If you can't secure a port, go build one. And boom, now you have land in Britain. Supposedly, if you have the navy to land in Britain, you probably have the army to invade it too, so you're good. Ooh, we get Volkswagen now on the Wikipedia page. It's not gonna say it's created by Adolf Hitler. It's gonna be created by Joseph Goebbels. And as I said already, if you manage to land in Britain, the war is basically over. I know guys who are technically kind of part of my team, but I don't want you guys just to be totalist, I want you to be nationally socialist. For some unknown reason, I cannot proclaim the Germanic state. And if you see on the picture very closely, I own every single land that the picture has. So I think I'm just gonna click it. Alright, this name placement is a little bit unfortunate, but uh, the Grossmannisches National Arbeitsstadt. I don't know what that means exactly. But it's something about Germany. I feel like there may be a small bug considering that the Feijan government, the Chinese nation, just declared war on Middle Africa. I think I did a focus to destroy every socialist nation around, but most of them were already dead after the international. So the last one is Spain. And, uh, you know, they're not totalists, which is very bad. So let's make him totalist. Uh, I expected Franco to be in power in Spain when I invaded, but no, we're gonna have Jose Antonio Primo de Rivita. Ah, uh, Leb. Lebets. Okay, how about we just call it place for the Germans? I think my domination of Europe is missing something. A very Mediterranean region. So let's take it. Hmm. An occupation of Italy by German forces. Where have I seen this one before? GG, Nori. After conquest of Sweden, it's time to establish the first Volksland. Volkswagen's Hydra. Alright, man, that just looks depressing if you ask me. Ah, much better. England, I had other plans for you. Yeah, I didn't want to evade you right now. Nah, no, English, you're not gonna stop my plans for invading the Baltics and then going east, like very east. Oh, now I can click the other funny button and I can establish the Butterland or something. Look at him, humor, bro. He's gaming. So, I'm um, invade Bulgaria to restore their natural borders. We may be a little bit late for a historical operation, Barbarossa. But it doesn't stop me from invading Russia, does it? So after he takes on Ukraine, we can finally make the other funny Volkstadt state. The war in Russia is fun and all, but I have another thing to do. I'm gonna go invade the Caucasus. Apparently, I don't have better work in my life. Um, I think something with the second Russian civil war which we're trying to implement just triggered. And Russia just blew up. 
So I'm gonna consider this a victory and take my lands. Apparently after you take Russia, your focus just keeps going. Oh yeah, and I realized what happened to Russia. Apparently when you kinda start to defeat them, just they blow up. And then you get decisions to just uh, annex the warlord. So we're going east. Like more east. Now guys, we can establish three of these cool nations at one. Boom, boom, boom. After quite some time of invading and going against, we have managed to get some quite good puppets. About the Baltics, Ruthenia, Moscovy, Israel or something. This guy. Yeah, I really don't know, man. M maybe there are more puppets I can get. I I'm not gonna bother finding them. Ooh, that's a big encirclement. I would say this is a huge late game encirclement. But not even that late game, bro. They just all stuck their people in Greece for some reason. We have subdued all but one nation on the continent. Finland, you are next. More like last, not next. So guys, this is gonna be the end of the video. Because after conquering all of Europe and Russia, so a bit of Asia too. I don't really feel like conquering all of the world. So, um, if you want to see me do this with Anarchy Germany, you can click here. If you want to watch something cool, you can click here. And if you want to subscribe to me, you can click here. And if you don't want any of that, bye.